It's me, it's your boy, it's DJ. Now, I just got finished doing my little unfinished let's play of Echo Stasis. And then on my way out, <laughs> back into Steam Big Picture mode, I see, I remember that I've just got this game called Pools. I played about 20 minutes of this already, and I confirmed that this is more... I'm going to be capable of getting through this. Although I'm playing it with headphones now. Jesus Christ, that was that, what's that going to be like? I have not beaten the first level. And there's audio. Somebody going down a ladder. Okay, and it just stops there. Oh. I actually resumed it where I'd quit. Cool. Is that cool? Because, look, the thing about this game, what I understand about it, is it's a big maze. And... <laughs> Yes, I finished Echo Stasis by saying that I can't do the maze it was providing me. But that's not because I have anything against mazes. I love mazes. I think they're extremely effective. And should be utilized more in video games. But a maze in a horror game, with enemies in it, that you got to navigate under a time limit, that's really, really stressful. And I don't know if I can do that. But a maze... like. I know for a fact that this game, Pools, has no enemies in it. You are literally in a big, surreal, indoor swimming pool environment maze thing. And that's it. That's it. No enemies. Just vibes. Lots and lots of vibes. Uh, how do I... How do I run? There's a way to run. I think, there we go. I think that's it. I made it to around here. I kind of given up. Or I stopped playing it around here because I got lost. The vibes are something else in this game. Because there's definitely audio. Wait. The dead end. That way. Are you telling me that I made it to the end <laughs> last time I played? Like the only time I played and I gave up when, when I couldn't find it? That was right here? God. This is not representative of what the game is like. Look, okay, so we'll finish this level and then you'll, you'll get to see me do the second level. <laughs> Probably. If this actually is the exit to the maze. It might not be. It might just have been the exit to that section. So look. Looks like you didn't... I can't really say that you missed much of the first 20 minutes of this game. It's just room after room. And also I'm, I've got a camera so I can zoom in and zoom out. So it's almost like a found footage kind of thing. And many of the rooms have these vistas like this. There are some set pieces. But... Like... It's just a lot of... walking. With noises that kind of indicate that I'm not alone. Although... I trust the game description when it says there are no monsters. It's 
a really like this this might be less of a let's play this might be more of a vibe of just hang around and chat or goodness don't fall I was going to a diving board anyway We Oh. Yeah, chapter one completed. So I was basically at the end. Okay. Okay, then you guys get to see chapter two. Because in Chapter 1, you had begun at the bottom of a ladder, but the ladder was in the ceiling, you couldn't reach it anymore, so you clearly dropped down. And you just go wandering through some rooms. There is a noise. There are noises. My point being, you're really not missing any context. I can never figure out if that's my character breathing or not. That's a big staircase. Also, when you've been in water, you actually leave, like, footprints, which is cool. Yeah, after playing Echostasis, I, I need <laughs> this kind of a break. One thing I'm not the hugest fan of for this game is that the walking speed is really slow. And even the camera speed is slow. Although, I'll give it this. The camera speed being slow means I'm slower to turn around. Which means I'm always expecting something when I turn around. So that that works well. Although I wish the walking speed was faster. And like the running speed, like this that's that's it? That's the running speed? So yeah, it's a bit of a sluggish game. And this being a maze, you will have to backtrack at some point. But whatever. ladder there in the middle of the pool. Did not see that. Just want to take a look. That is pure darkness. Let's do it. That's really far. What am I looking at? There's something over there. A solid... Like, do you see that? A little... I don't know if you can even see it on YouTube, but it's like a little... There's something out there. That's actually freaking me out. Like, no thank you. If I've got to go that way, then I will. But not if I don't have to. Yeah. This is better for my nerves, me being able to talk. This is the kind of game that I kind of wish was in VR. Circle and triangle. What do you say? Circle or triangle? I mean, we're here at a circle. So... Like, it just makes sense. Go with the thing that we were at. Circle. Let's go a bit faster. 
step, 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 step. And I, I have seen things move in this. It's only ever been inanimate objects. But I have seen it. This is the kind of game up that I'd want to make. Just a maze. Nothing more. Well, like a big vibe in a maze. This is dark. So there's all these chairs everywhere. So that was circle, that's triangle. Yeah, circle took me here. Huh. But God, I'm so curious about every path. That, that's mazes for you. This is not the way I came. lockers over there. Just the acoustics of my own footsteps. <laughs> I can't walk through there. Definitely our sounds. Chairs. Darkness. Let's walk through the darkness. What is that? Big statue. That's the first humanoid thing I've seen. Good god, that darkness really comes on quick. There's another path to go. I don't see anything. Yeah, this is just a pool. It doesn't look like there's anywhere to go from there. So we gotta go this way. Locker. Locker room maze. Nope. Nope. Can't go 
through there. Okay, this is icy. This is what we were looking at before. Yeah, you can probably tell I'm not the best person to play horror games. But I like to think that that's like, not a bad thing for a Let's Play. If, if I get scared of something and therefore I don't show you it, that, like, in theory, that would just make you more curious. Like, you would make you, the viewer, more curious. Because you can handle horror games. Good God. If you can handle horror games, then let me be an advertisement for games that might give you good vibes. Jesus! Wasn't expecting that color change. So clearly we got a That'll just take me back into that room, right? Yep. Where's this ladder gonna take me? Good God. pit. <sighs> we <laughs> didn't make a single sound effect. I think this game has its own kind of appeal. I think it's self-evident. There is just something about endlessly walking through... What the fuck was that? You guys saw that, right? <laughs> I'm just trying to talk, man. The rubber ducky. That thing gave me a jump scare in the first map. Five concentric circles. Where'd the... Where'd your buddy go? Oh, there you are. Okay. Alright.
It's gotta be my own character breathing, first of all. Second of all, deep music? I have not noticed any music at all so far in this game. guy. That's the statue. I guess it was a different statue. You okay, buddy? Where's your face? Alright, let's dare to sit down. heard that, right? If I take my hand off the controller... Get up. Oh, I was already up. That was new. <laughs> that, that, that nearly startled me. Just it's just a slide. We just go walking, walking. Walking, climbing these stairs. Yeah. Let's do it. Wee. 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 Dope. Climb up. Yeah, that was fun. This is a staircase.
Right. So that's what happens when you die. I also found that out in the first one. I didn't realize that was going to kill me. Just like a drop. I just wanted to see. to be able to interact with it, but I just pushed around. Very conspicuous blue slide. Yeah, chapter two completed. We. Yeah. Well, let's keep it going. The first time I played this, I didn't find the exit to the first chapter, although apparently I was really close. But like now I've already found two exits. So what's what's going to be the deal with this one, this chapter? It's getting narrower and narrower. Turn around. Right. Uh, right, we'll just go this way. Waterfalls. How pretty. architecture. I want to go through this rectangle. No, I don't. Cool. Good to know. Saunas. Gotta love a sauna. Have you guys ever been in a sauna? I've been in a sauna. They're hotter than you expect. It feels like you're just sitting in an oven for a while. But on purpose. And mind you, it being on purpose is actually is a pretty good thing.
Yeah, it being on purpose is a good thing. Because <clears throat> if it's just like a heat wave, a regular old heat wave, which you didn't choose to go through, that sucks. But if you go into a place expecting it to be that hot, it can be pretty nice. It's a bit like dreaming for a while. However, I don't get many opportunities to go in saunas because I live in England where like they're they're not really a common thing here. Hmm. Where does that green one go? I will go down it in a second. Just taking a look. Uh-huh, that's where the green one goes. Okay. Let's go. Yeah! Eee! Woo! I thought I was gonna smack into that wall. Oh, so that was it. It was just for the slide, then you go back up. Okay, fair enough. Take the red one then. Yeah. So curious about everything. little hot tubs. Let's sit here for a second. Yeah, you said it, man. They put the controller down. Does it start playing noises? No. That was just to do with that statue. Damn. Just gonna ignore that. And that. They're just pipes. This place has a lot of pipes. Where's that slide even going to take me? I literally don't know. Meanwhile, there's lockers. Or bathrooms. These are stalls. <laughs> so I've got to go in the... Oh, I can open all of them. Are you going to Silent Hill me? No. Okay. Okay, then let's take the slide. Let's see where the hell it goes. We're going there very fast. Oh. This is a lot less dangerous.
really disconcerting to have my character breathe after I've been going fast. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, that went deeper. Jesus, okay, that gave me some goosebumps for a second. Just had big flashbacks to Condemned, and also to Nightmare House 2. They're not facing me. They're not facing me. The <laughs> feeling I got when I rounded that corner and my eyes resolved in what I was looking at. Oh. Wow. Is this going to be... Are we going to walk up the wall? Yeah. Oh, I love that. That's what I've been wanting. There's the game, Manifold Garden, which is filled with that kind of physics. It's really cool. It's still not quite an antechamber. Like, antechamber is about, like, the pinnacle of the mindfuck kind of game. Manifold Garden was going for something a bit more mathematical and realistic. Well, realistic according to non-Euclidean non mathematics. But ah! Oh! Jeez! Was that supposed to be my footsteps? Or no? God, okay, yeah, this game is getting somewhere now. Fuck yeah. Oh, I love it. I love it. The thing is, this is all a game needs to be. This is a legit video game. Where navigation is the challenge. And navigation keeps you engaged. And along the way, we also deal with the content of what I'm navigating. That also keeps me engaged. Y you okay, man? If I just stand here for a second. Any noises? No? Okay. Okay, just figured out offer. Yeah, so y you engage with the content of what you're navigating. You process it in your brain. You have emotional reactions in your brain. Pairs of legs. There's some hands. So 
someone just sitting there. Yeah, this looks great. Love the aesthetic. Why is there nowhere to go? There's a staircase, okay. Okay, well, before I go up there, let's go sit in that chair. There we go. All right, if I hand off the controller. Oh, okay, I'm not looking anywhere. No particular direction. Alright, fine. I love the black and white. This looks really cool. We just, we gotta, you know, you know we gotta. What? Oh, nothing. Dear God. Oh, dear God. This is anxious as all hell. <sighs> Just having all the doorways around you. But luckily, it was a really easy maze to solve, because that wasn't really a maze. God, this is gorgeous. This is so nice. What was that? Okay, well, I loved that chapter. That chapter, like, this is picking up. Much to my surprise, this is picking up. I see. Okay, the ceiling came out. Or the floor came out. Now I'm in a big wooden space. This is... Okay. Okay. Was did but did, 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 did Okay, you know what? That that achievement actually made that less scary. But not by that much. I definitely got goosebumps. I got weirded out. I got alarmed. And I, I, I want to go over there. Because, like, I was going to pause and, like, just stand here for a bit and talk. Because I have noticed artifacts whenever I turn around or round a corner. I've noticed artifacts of the object in front. And I was wondering if that was actually, like, my player model. But just an artifact of it. Of course, then I realized that there is no player model, because if, if, 
There's never been arms or legs or anything, or even a shadow. But <laughs> the achievement confirmed it. God, that startled me. Definitely startled me. That also took me a second to register. That Silent Hill 4 called. They want their that back. The fuck? I can't go over there. I've got to go this way. Oh! <laughs> okay, they're just those. I didn't know what I was looking at. The ladder there that goes nowhere. Alright. Let's just, let's go this way. All this walking is working up an appetite. So when we're done with this, I'm going to have a nice pizza. I was hoping this was an infinite staircase, but it's not. Nothing at the top of the stairs. Fine, let's go this way. I didn't actually want to go this way. Ladder. What, you're not going to grab the ladder? The most obvious... Man, you interact with every chair, but there's a freaking ladder and you don't even touch it? Let's go this way. One thing I admire about this game is that it is not just a maze. It is a maze where I don't actually want to see every dead end and every path. I'm just taking the first path that comes to me. And that feels good in an existential way. This decision that I'm not going to... I'm not going to see all that there is to see, but like, at least I'm going to be able to get through this in an expedient amount of time. This is... No, it's not. It's not the same staircase. You, you don't have to go to that ladder. That's fine. Let's go a bit faster. Let's climb down a bit. We haven't gone in a circle, have we? No. No, we haven't. No. But I'm, we're probably going to find the beginning of that slide up here. Let's go up there anyway.
Yeah, I'll climb this ladder. Another staircase. A door. And I can't open it. I wasn't expecting to see a door. Or another staircase. I'm happy with this. This is cool. Like, sincerely. This is sincerely really cool. I'm loving how lost I'm feeling. What's in here? Yellow. Jesus. There's so many ways to go. And I love that too. Am I walking in circles? I definitely walked in a circle. I had to have. Yeah, you guys get to see me get lost. Alright, what's down here? The stairs. And this. Whatever this is. Dark. Wow, this is dark. Oh, no. Oh, I don't like this. Oh. I'm not opening these. Do I have to? Do I have to open one of them? This is a dead end. Man, I, I don't... <coughs> I don't like it. I'm... I'm not... I'm not hanging around. Because, like, I mean, look, I, I know this. It's not going to be a jump scare. It's not going to be something that, that threatens me. It's not even going to be scary. But just, like, my brain's communicating things to me, and I'm listening to it. It's telling me, let's not hang around this headspace for a while. Like, let's not. So I don't. This is new. See about getting to the top of this. Or at least until there's a way forward. Like, I can hang around this headspace. This is a better headspace. I've been here before, haven't I? Yeah, I've totally been here before. I'm scared that if I go down one of these slides, it's just going to backtrack me. You know, the snakes and ladders. If you go down a snake, you're back 
a bunch. Goodness. That's where the blue one goes. So if I find an entrance to the blue one, I don't need to take it. I'll take a slide if it doesn't waste my time that much. I don't want to backtrack. Hey there. Whoa. Yeah, speaking of headspaces that I don't want to spend too long in. Here's one of them. Yeah, I regret taking that path. A little door. This feels safer, somewhat. I have a choice. No, this is this is one of those deaths. Yeah. Why not? Why not take it? Let's walk past it now. Alright, a bunch of people. A bunch of statues. And there's nowhere to go but to the statues. This is probably the end of the chapter. Hey, how you doing? Yep, chapter four. Now we're in chapter five. We Right. So what's awaiting us here? There's only like two chapters left. So what the hell is bricks? A bunch of bricks. And a door. Okay. What are you? Oh, you're just a chair. If 
thought it was like an invisible person. These are bricks. So is the motif for this one going to be, it's not a maze. Like, it's a linear path. good-looking ones. And simple slides. Oh, I like blue. Let's go for blue. Eee! Yeah. So this probably isn't linear then. It's just bricks. Another chair. Diving boards. I'm I'm good. That's dark, and it's also the only way to go. Let's look over here. Manhole. This looks modern. Yeah, this looks like an actual building. I'm okay with that. Sound of wood settling. Right. Voices are baffling me. The 
noises are very, very baffling me. So I can't switch gravity. I just gotta look around. There we go. I love this because this is, you know, an area from a dif different chapter, but seen from another perspective. way. Yeah. This is what I like to see. Jesus. Hey there, buddy. Yeah, that's where I was... That's where I was seated. Looking at this guy. Yeah. Whoop. <laughs> Just warping up the ladder. Fair enough. Whoop. Dive achievement. Then there's a little slide. Look around first. Probably gonna take me down there. Woo! God, am I walking into the back rooms now? might actually be. Why did it get dark? Back to the regular aesthetic, but just a really big room. Fine by me. God, just that is massive. 
Right, which of these do I want to take? I mean, blue is the one, th the color that I like. Ah! That is fun. Fucking massive. All the little pools. Another chair. Let my character catch his breath. in here? What's in there? I've got to go this way. I mean, this is awesome. I definitely feel like I'm in Secret City now. And few things make me feel like I'm in Secret City. Defeat me with a with a maze, you are sorely mistaken. Escalator. But there's still one more chapter though. Stand here. <coughs> I'm gonna stand here and ride it if I want to. But let's walk. Oh, 
little house. A door and this can be another one of these. Fine by me. Is this door going to open? Yes. That's a complete surprise to me. up here nothing okay well, this door is not going to open nope. right, let's see what this final chapter goodness Clearly inside a house, or the aesthetic of a house.
just sit here for a second. Okay. I don't need to sit on all of them. Oh, man. Yeah, I should also say out loud here that I'm getting a speechless. This game is making me speechless a lot. It's, it's just hitting exactly my aesthetic. It's hitting what it needs to hit to make me speechless. Just taking in information. Navigating. Well, I don't really get the inner tubes. I, mean, I don't know what there is to get, but like they, they don't creep me out. They make me feel safe. Right. And there's no point to going this way? No. I'm just going into the slide. Jeez. Giant sauna? Yeah, giant sauna. Well, on one hand, I'm speechless, and I'm taking in this information, and I'm registering that this final chapter seems like a, 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 a pinnacle of a, a reprisal of all the motifs they've established so far. I'm also feeling a lot less scared. Yep, see, what did I tell you? Reprisals, because here's another staircase. I'm feeling a lot less scared. But I don't think they're actually going to scare me anymore. That's really cool. I like that. So for six chapters in, I've seen the kinds of scares they're going for. I don't expect anything new. And I'm partly saying that because I'm hoping that I'm jinxing it. A giant saw blade. That's the end. No, it's the beginning of the slide. Well, let's go.
Yep. Turn around. Okay, that's all. Oh, it's a pipe. That's all that is. stuck on. Okay, there we go. Pillows in here. Good places you can sleep. Just gonna have me keep walking around these idle rooms until the finish. A star. Well, this is dark. Escalator. Okay, fine. Let's go for the escalator. Up. They're all going up. Nice. I guess it's cute. Twelve. 
toilets. Ladders going out into the abyss. Let's go that way. Or is this going to be another... No, it's just a dead end. Huh. I'm okay with that. There is actually something unsettling about seeing one of the pillows on the floor. I guess because by definition it's unsettling. It is something that is settled, but it's not settled anymore. No, I've totally been here. So I managed to walk in a circle. Right. So it's just, it's a maze and I've got to find the way out. Okay. Let's see what I can do. I made it to th this far in chapter 6, man. I'm not going to give up. Sorry, I'm just realizing. <laughs> Good God. I'm realizing just, just how far in a circle I've gone. Just gotta find another path to take. path I haven't taken. I'm not going to be defeated by a maze. been defeated by a maze once today. <coughs> I'm not going to be defeated a second time.
to the star, that's right. It's way down. Let's go this way. You're alive. Just a lamb lying down on a sofa. It's almost a, ge a Genesis reference. This is new. Keeps on going. God, yes. Straight up secret city. That's the rubber ducky in the small maze. <coughs> that one definitely scared me. Giant chair. The fucking Garfield. Garfield and normal. Little monster. 
can't sit in that chair. Nothing. Cute. Where am I going now? As usual, you give me... No, you don't. Okay, just one path. Subway. And sit down. Don't just sit down, man. Didn't want to sit down. A bed. This is also cute. It's you. So that's what that picture is. Okay. Yes, I was expecting the, the mannequin to come and chase me. I might still be expecting that. We saw its picture a lot. It's just more of this. chair in the darkness. Okay, fine.
feels like a longer chapter than normal. Hi. Jesus. This is a long chapter. And we're back to narrow hallways. Back to a maze. God, the narrow maze is what defeated me in echostasis. Didn't want to hear that. I'm not in control of this. Why are you putting the camera down? What? 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 Okay, so he closed the door. But so where'd you get the videotape from? Did the other guy go back to live with the mannequins? Is that what I'm try supposed to get from this?
Ser seriously, where where'd you get the videotape from? Cause the whole point here is that we were looking for an exit. If you got the videotape, then that means that there was an exit. But somebody else found it. And the camera. I don't know. It, like, I enjoyed that game, I'd say. It was mainly a lot of mazes, which I'm cool with that. I think it... I think it could have ended after five. Like, number five was a good ending. And it, it would have been perfectly symbolic. It wouldn't have needed an explanation of, like, somebody's watching the videotape. I don't know. I was definitely getting tired during number six. And the tone was very different for number six as well. It was feeling like it was... It was feeling like a thesis. It, was, it felt like the, we were seeing a lot of symbolic imagery that summarized a greater message, but then it just ended with the mannequins. And like, like, man, if you were gonna do the mannequin scares, you really should have done them a lot more earlier. Should have filled this game with a lot more scares. I don't know, I'm not overly attached to that mannequin ending. We'll take a look at the achievements. I probably missed, yeah, I missed half of them. Did you hear that? No, you do, don't follow the most obvious path. Yeah, whatever. Like I, oh, but apparently that, apparently catching a glimpse of the thing was very rare. Even rarer than that one. Cool. I'm happy with that. Yeah, well, we had a little bit of vibe. And it definitely calmed me down after echostasis. Will I ever play this again? Probably not. But should you play it? P play a bit of it, yeah? <laughs> if you really want a, the full two hours, then go for it. I'm not going to tell you not to play it. Bound to have been things in there that I missed. Because it's a bunch of mazes. There's paths I didn't take. And, uh, yeah. I think I'm done playing video games for tonight. I'm definitely done talking for tonight. And my voice hurts. Yeah, catch you later. Thank you for watching. And at some point, I'll upload the rest of Layers of Fear. Although I can't finish that game because there's a glitch. I'd have to replay the entire thing and try to get the same endings, which would take a while. So I, I don't know. So it was just more fun to play other games. But yeah, see you later.